Hey, how you doing today? My name's Aurelia, and thanks for stopping by. Today, we're going to look at how to find sunken ships. And the reason why you're looking for sunken ships is because they hold all kinds of different treasure. They essentially can have any type of loot in the game, uh, except for the Skull Fort treasures, as far as my understanding goes. Uh, you can literally find the tea, you can find skulls, you can find treasure chests, you can even find uh, messages in a bottle. Um, so the best way to find these things is to just kind of keep a lookout on the horizon for some seagulls and if you see some seagulls like oh that right there that's how you know that you're going to find either some uh, a set of barrels or you're going to find a sunken ship so just look off in the distance and we will see what we see when we get there let's go check this out they recently added an update. It used to be that the seagulls would only show you where a sunken ship was. And as of right now, the seagulls will show you where sunken ships are or um, just a bunch of barrels that are out in the ocean. Let's go. Oh. All right. So we're getting into the boat. Oh, I should have uh, dropped off cannonballs and stuff, but it's all right. See. Oh, there's a chest. Ooh, that's a good chest, too. What is this one called? Ooh, captain's chest. Just like that. Alright, uh, how do I get out of here? I am a little bit turned around. Alright, so that's down further, which I definitely don't want. Uh oh. Uh, it's hard for me to tell because I am taking damage. Alright, so, fun fact, if you are about to die, you can drop your chest and swim up to the top of the water, because you can swim faster without holding a chest, and the chest will float once you pick them up. I got sharks on me? Okay, that's not good, because I am almost dead. Alright, perfect, because I'm almost dead. So, what just... Did a shark just get me? Okay. So this is a decent little hole that we got from that one shipwreck. It's not so bad. We got three different spice crates and a skull. Uh, the black one sells for, I believe, over a thousand gold. And it just means that we have that many less... Uh, merchant chicken quest running things that we have to do uh, that much less sailing uh, before leveling up so I'm super hyped on this um, if you found this helpful in any way shape or form uh, please make sure to leave a comment down below um, or consider subscribing there's gonna be a bunch of more Sea of Thieves content coming soon I appreciate you guys and I'll talk to you again more soon